Hey everyone, welcome to series 21 of Spring Festival Playlist. As usually, I'm gonna show you the weekly Forza tone and also the cars I've been using in the championships. So let's have a look. Oh, and there is a new car, a nice drift Ferrari this week. But let's go to the Forza tone challenge. First, the Forza tone shop. 2008 Koenigsegg. Very good car. If you have the points, definitely buy that car. Very good in S2. Maserati Levante, also a very good car, but you probably can get it from the auction. And then we have these emotes and car horn. So let's have a look what we need to do. We need to own and drive a Super GT car. We need to have 10 pass skills. We need to have 9. It's a total of 9 stars, so that's okay. And the 3 stars at Princess Street Speed Trap. And that's been a problem to get it a few times already so but it's okay uh, we got a good car for it so it won't be a problem so let's do the 10 pass skills what you need to do it's that's a very simple one I'll put it off you go to the drag strip here just take this one just wait a second and then start and the first time I had five passes so I did it twice and then you have the 10 pass skills then the next one we need nine stars on drift zone now the best drift zone you can actually take for that well i find it a very easy one that's this one here uh, here it is so you just start here the car is a little bit tuned for drift but also for handling for the next for the speed trap Oh well that went a little bit wrong but you only need oh uh, let me try this again that was a complete fail there you go It was not raining when I tuned the car, so I have a little bit more problems now to handle the car. But you just need three points. So I advise you to do it not in the rain. But doesn't matter, you just need um, nine points in total. Then we need to go to the speed trap at Princess. So let's have a look at the speed trap. There you go. So that's this one. Um, you just start from here. Now I am very unlucky that it's raining. So I hope I have a little bit of grip. And of course, I have traffic. But you can get it in fifth gear. I have seven kilometers uh, too short. That's because I had to avoid traffic. I'll show it again. So from the moment you got a car, a traffic in that corner, it's very hard to do. As you can see, it's they put the cars there on purpose. I had only one run that I didn't have a car there. Now it's already an annoying speed trap. So it would be nice if they actually don't put a car there. And you can basically stay in 5th gear, or you switch to 5th, doesn't matter, and then you have it. See, if there's no car uh, at the corner, you can easily get it. 
So this is the car that I used for that, the 2013 Alston Martin V12 Vantage S. Now let's go over the championships. The trial, the trial was very interesting. Um, I'll tell you one thing, the third race is the Goliath. Um, I lost the race because the first race we lost. Uh, the second race we won and then the third race on the Goliath um, one guy had a higher top speed than me what did he do he passed me on the straight and well basically he took three Dravatars with him that made us lose so maybe if you people look at the points we have and you see that we are driving as a team either stay behind or well just look at the points and stay behind because you drive as a team doesn't matter who wins just don't do like that um, because you waste people's time because your ego is too high to be first so please don't do that again it's just stupid now the car that I use for that is the we need a Lotus you're gonna think what the hell are you taking well i'm taking the 2340r lotus why you can just go flat out in the two races two first races um easily to win uh the goliath well as long as there's nobody with a higher top speed that passes you and takes the rubber banding gravitas with you you can easily win also with that but then again you have people that have too much ego uh, what can you win? We win the Lotus 11. Okay, let's go to the next one. That would be Playgrounds. Playgrounds is B700 Retro Rally at Mudkickers. Let's have a look what cars that we can take for that. So we take a B. And then we go to Retro Rally. There you go. Now, this one is faster then this one and this one is also a fast one so basically you can pick between those three um well it's basically what you prefer to take but you can take one of these three then let's go to the next one the showcase remix uh that's with the nice lambu contact it doesn't steer um at Playgrounds, as you can see, we win the 2011 Ford F-150. Now let's go to Harley Sprung. We need a B700 Hot Hatch. Now you got several cars for that, but the car I took for that was actually this one. The 2016 Abarth 695 Biposto. I had completely no problems uh, winning the championships with this car. It's very fast and you won't have problems with it. The car that you win is a Renault Clio. Now let's go to the next championship. Ferrari where we get the new Ferrari. So we need an S1 900 Country Italy modern supercar. Now that was a little bit uh, fuss to actually find um, the right car for that. So we need modern supercar and then we need the country Italy. So let's go. So I got a bunch of cars here. Now I tuned a few and I didn't really like it till I came on the Ferrari, the 2013 458 Speciale. Very good car, grippy, drives very well, no problems to win the championship. Um, so it was very easy with this car i tried this car a few other cars but at the end this car that's why the video also took a little longer to make this one actually went very well now the car that we win i will show you at the end of the video we will go over the festival playlist old habits die hard we need a b700 vintage racer now vintage racers are expensive cars so let's have a look it's all 
down there you go so what do we have the expensive 10 million cars now first of all you can also i don't know if this one uh, is able to go in b class i didn't check that this is a seasonal car you can't buy it so i didn't take it if you don't have money enough just come to my stream tonight um you don't need the car if you go in convoy or if you just want to do it with your friends if one friend has the car everybody can use the car but the bugatti type 35c is the best car to actually use this for this championship the car that we win is a regera so now let's have a look at all the stunts there is also an annoying one that i know from previous times people had problems with it so i actually going to my hoonigan this time the s2 version let's have a look first of all this one everybody knows this one is a really really annoying one um it's not always easy to get it uh let's see where do i need to start that i'm on top i'll just go here let me see Turn around when it's there is it it's on this side uh, let's go here now you need to go sideways why because you do not have the jump for some reason I'm teleporting completely wrong all the time I guess it's not really my day today why here that's the there you need to go well you know sitting at home with all that lockdown and corona it seems that the brains are getting a little bit out there you go I'm almost there. Have a little bit of patience with me. I'm also getting old, you know. Ah, uh, there is the road that I needed. So as you can see, I'm going. I'm gonna come from the sides. Um, oh yeah, that was the road that I needed. So you see those two trees here. I just start on third. I see a traffic car. If you go sideways here, you have less um, bumps, and you will get a uh, jump way easier there you go so what you need to do is from here i'll show you again you teleport here and then you drive up here with the two trees and then you turn around when it's safe to do so you see the big trees you just go here don't steer too much And there you go see it's very easy to come from that side don't go straight on it you won't get it unless you are very lucky that you have speed enough with that jump okay now let's go to this one this one was not that hard you just need to break in the corners but i've done everything with the uh, with this car here the hoonigan rs 200 I can tell you one thing the hoonigan with everything off in simulation and S2 is very hard to control so if you prefer to do it in normal I advise you to do that but the hoonigan is fast enough to actually do this there you go and then the last one is here also a tricky one you need to start from i think i started from here yeah you need to try to go s as straight as possible so there next to this tree you go down 
Don't steer too much. As you can see, you will fail. But then again, I always fail when I do my stuns on my videos. But that's the fun of it. So just go here next to this tree. Don't steer too much. Take your own advice, Falister. And you will have it. There you go. That's it. Oh wow, I even got a new PB. Well, that's the advice I can give you for the stunts. So let's have a look at that Drift Ferrari. Um, it is... Where is it? Formula Drift. There we go. Also, one other thing. I posted on my Instagram and Twitter that it's a 2018. Now, what, I've, what I can see here is 2018 Formula Drift number 117 599 GTB Fiorano. That's basically here it says a 2007. So I don't know which one is a normal build here, but on the website or either in the game. They made a little mistake. So let's get into the car. So as you can see, it's already pre-tuned. You can see it on the on the reels in front that they are looking outside. It's clearly real wheel drive. It seems very stable in real wheel drive. That's gonna be an interesting car to tune. The sound is pretty okay for a Ferrari in this game. Oh, this is gonna be a fun car to drift. I'm definitely gonna tune this for, uh, yeah, well, for drifts. Not for to race like some people do. Well, this is the new car, complete new car in the game. Um, I'm not sure if it's a 2018 or 2007. This one, I have to look it up uh, on Google. But this is the car that you get. Looks pretty neat. Yeah. Now, what else do we get here? We get the KTM Xbo GT4 at 50% and at 80% the Ferrari 599XXE. Very good car, OP car in S2 online adventure in dirt and road. By the way, this car, so definitely try to get it. Um, you will love it if you like racing. So that's it. I'll be streaming tonight, uh, doing the trial, playgrounds and all other stuff to help people out. And hopefully the video helped you. It's a little bit longer than normal. Um, but then again, if the cars helped you win the championships, leave me a like and a comment. And I will be happy to help you. Okay, see you tonight.